Hello everybody, this is Dr. Kevin Connors, and this is episode 9 of my personal journey. I'm titling this, The Dark Night of the Soul. I know everybody has dark nights of the soul, nights that you're struggling with the reason why of everything, how to pray, how to, how to search for meaning in all of what's going on in your life. Well, I have those times too, and during those times I can fall back on the truth that I serve a sovereign God, and even when I don't know what's going on, I can trust Him, and that's what gives me comfort. Just knowing that I can crawl up on His lap and have Him just, just stroke my hair and rub my belly and tell me everything's going to be okay, and that I don't need to know why, I don't need to know when, I don't need to know what that he's my daddy, and he loves me enough, and I need to trust him in that. So even through my struggles and my dark nights of the soul, God gives me comfort to continue on just knowing that I can trust him through it all. Well, one of the ways God uses me, or at least how he speaks to me, is he gives me words to write. I'm not an artist. I can't, I can't paint beautiful pictures and, and give meaning in that. But he gives me poems. As corny as they seem to other people, maybe. That's just how he speaks to me and how he comforts me. And I'm going to share one with you that I just wrote last night when it was a dark night in my soul. Up in pain, couldn't sleep, just struggling through those same questions that you all have. And trusting and falling into his lap at the end because he's my daddy. And he loves me more than anything. And I can trust that without knowing everything. So this little poem that he gave me is called, Should I? Should I pray for healing? Should I pray for rest? When I pray for wisdom, should I ask you for what's best? Should I pray for others to make their bodies whole? Should I ask for physical or more to heal the soul? I pray that you take of me the deepest part to be refined. Protect my wife, my family, Lord. I pray for all I'll leave behind. When I whine in anger and what in pity cry, I ask your Holy Spirit to bring right words to your side. For I don't know how and I don't know why. And I don't understand your ways and I don't even know how to try. But simply surrendered I fall before your feet for I am wholly yours Lord there is nothing more in me just glorify your name in me I pray glorify your name I pray and hold me in your arms and tell me all will be okay all will be okay. And it's in that comfort that I know that God loves you and me. And he just wants to hold us sometimes and hush us in our sadness and tell us everything's going to be okay. It's going to be okay.